Hello, thanks for joining us on TVC News at 12. The Center for General Nigeria Studies of the Lagos State University has unveiled a book chronicling the impact of the institution's uh, Vice Chancellor, Professor Ibiemi Olatunjibeli, on education and the public service in Nigeria. We have details in this report. Gathered in this hall are leaders from the academia, government, and business sector. They are here to celebrate a woman who made history as the first female vice chancellor of the Lagos State University and her achievements so far. The 160 page book titled The Chronicles of Professor Ibiemi Ibilola Olatunji Bello was co authored by Professor Mubashiru Muhammad and Martin Adekoya. Director of the Center for General Nigerian Studies, Professor Mubashiru Muhammad said the book was published to celebrate the purposeful leadership of the VC, especially as she marks her third anniversary in office. Vice Chancellor of the Lagos State University of Education and the book reviewer, Professor Bidemi Lafiaji Okuneye, described Lasso versus story as a beacon of help to women in leadership and the academia. She consistently engaged robustly with the government, industries, and even the unions in ensuring peace and to ensure that the university move forward. A central theme of the book is the transformative power of education. Professor Latunis Bello philosophy emphasizes inclusivity, empowerment, and the importance of nurturing intellectual curiosity. The chairman of the occasion, who is a special assistant to the president on sustainable development goals in her part, said, Professor Latonje Bello's tenure has brought unprecedented development to Lasso. Her administration has expanded the academic and infrastructural horizons of the university, betting three new faculties and a school in, the, for, in this 40-year-old institution. The honorary Professor Ibiemi Olatojebelo, who commended the initiative of the book, described it as a call to do more and give back to the society. When Professor Mohamed approached me with the idea to write this book and celebrate me this way, I immediately told him that the university does not have any resources to commit to. I decided to see how he and his team would achieve it. And here we are. Thank you very much. The book stands as a testament to resilience and hard work, which many agree will continue to inspire others.